Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, the Ghettoographer, aka Pastor Tech, coming to you with some bad news. Do me a favor, don't buy this product. The Evertronic double, double 5,000 milliamp double MagSafe battery pack. Do not buy this. I was halfway through the video and um, went somewhere with my wife, took the batteries with me, and um, something, I noticed something very, 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 very wrong. So the only reason why I'm still you know, putting this video out, allowing this video to go out, is because I taped it, was almost through with the video until I found this glaring mistake. So please do me a favor, please watch the video. Please do that for me and get to the end, or you can skip to the end, and it will tell you, I will tell you why not to buy this battery pack. Again, this is the Even Eventronic double pack MagSafe battery pack, 5,000 milliamp hour battery. So 5,000 milliamp hour battery pack. So please do not buy. Um, I'm putting this video out because I don't want a good video to go to waste. So do me a favor, please look at the whole video, get to the end, and it'll tell you why you shouldn't buy it. All right, peace. Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? It's your boy, The Ghettoographer, a.k.a. Pastor Tech, coming back at you with another unboxing video. And today, we got three things that we're going to be unboxing today, or unbagging. The first thing is this right here, this power bank. This is a 5,000 milliamp hour power bank. It's a double. So you get, for $21.99 is the price, you get two 5,000 milliamp hour MagSafe battery bank battery packs of battery banks um right and this right here do some of this guy um over current protection overcharge protection short circuit protection over discharge protection and over voltage protection in other words it got a whole bunch of over stuff protecting it so this right here gonna cost you 21.99 again it's 5,000 milliamp hours for two for both of the batteries so together they're a thousand but two separate batteries and then we got this case right here this case was 1999 this case is a magsafe um case for um for my pixel pro 8 so we're gonna see how this will go with that and then we have a the samsung 23 ultra right here this has no name on it but this was 21.99 and again this is magsafe as well so without further ado let's get to the eagle eye view but before we get there please do me very please like share and subscribe and say that one more time please like share and subscribe to the channel and do me a favor give me some thumbs up give me some likes because they help us get deeper into the youtube algorithm so we can get further so these videos can get further out there get reaching more people so without further ado let's get to the eagle live view we're in the eagle live view we're gonna go ahead and open up this first so we'll set this to the side this shouldn't be a, a long unboxing at all so now like i said these are $21.99, and they come with two batteries, and it also comes with two cables. It comes with the uh, sorry, guys, taking a little long. It comes with the USB, USA to USC, USB C. USB A, and it comes with two USB Cs right here. So that's pretty good. Kind of thick too. They're not that. They're not that cheap filling. Kind of thicker than the normal ones. So there you go. And then let's get down with these right here. And we're gonna get the unboxing, get everything out. Then we're gonna go ahead. Test it out. Now these look a little different. They got raised up here, so they got raised. Oh, I don't like that, but we got on. There are, there are two they're charged up halfway. This is how they look, guys. Got a button. Got the USB-C right here. Sorry. That's about it. Same thing on here. Raised. I don't like that raised now. See, Anchor? I'm liking the Anchor one a little bit better because it's got that it's got that little raised stuff, but maybe that's because it's helping. So this one's this one's charged up to a three. So that one's two, this one's three. Okay, so this is that. Again, these are going for twenty twenty one ninety nine. dollars Then we have this right here. This right here is uh twenty one ninety nine as well. This is the the ultra twenty three ultra. 
723 Ultra case with MagSafe on it. So, let's see how this looks. Dun, 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 dun. All right, that's not bad. So, we have... Okay, we got that going on here. We got the mag, we got the circle here. So we have the little kickstand. That's not bad, guys. We're gonna put it on in a minute. See, this is supposed to go right here, so it does stick on there. So see, it does stick pretty good and strong too. The magnets are pretty strong. It's not bad. All right, so we got that, and then let's go with this one right here. This is for the Pixel. 8 Pro, and this is going to be $19.99 for this one here. This one's, I wonder if this is real leather. Give me one second, guys. I don't think it is. It looks like it. I don't think it is. So this is for the um, the Pixel 8 Pro, so you can see, you know. But it's supposed to have the MagSafe, and it has the, the kickstand. It still has the kickstand. Okay. So let's see how this goes. All right, guys. Let's see if, if it sticks. Yep, right there. So... I like, you know, so we'll see how they charge up. So, guys, let's go ahead and get the batteries charged up. Um, well, not get the batteries charged up. Sorry, guys. Why don't we go ahead and see how they look when they charge up, and then we'll put the phones aside, the cases, and see how it looks, how it feels, and and see if it charges up um, using the MagSafe, um, the cases with the batteries. So, we'll be right back, guys. So, we'll be getting to doing some you know, testing out and stuff like that. But I also bought this right here. And I'll tell you why in a little bit. But let's see how this one looks. And here we go. We have another MagSafe here. Yeah. So we have three different MagSafe, two for the Galaxy. And one for the actual um um google um 8 pro right here so as you can see we have three the rings are there's a reason why i'll let you know why i got this one from the mall in a little bit so why don't we go ahead and before we um get into testing everything why don't we go ahead and see how these these charges charge up So here we go. We got this right here connected to the wall. We have these two, and I'm going to go get this one right here. So we have that here. So what we're going to do, go ahead and see how it looks when it charges up. Okay, we're going to plug this is one plugged into the wall, and there you go. That's how it looks when it charges up. You have the button here. Okay. Then we're going to the sec the second one. It's plugged up into the wall. There we go. All right. The on and off button right there. So as you can see, nice and thin. I do like them because they're thin. Got the Pixel 8 Pro right here. So what we're going to do, we're going to give it a test out. We're going to put it in here. This is how it looks. Move this out the way a little bit. I'm sorry, guys. I'm all messy out here. So we got this little kickstand here, which is pretty good. I'll do it like that, so it's pretty decent. This is the name of it, the case right here. So I'll put this in the description below. So let's get to charging. There we go. We got this right here, guys, and we're going to see if it works. So we're going to put it on. We're going to make sure we turn it on, turn this off. So we'll make sure we turn this on so you can see right here. Then we're going to put this right there, and there you go. It works. See, it's unlocked by face, so I'm going to let you see it works. That's pretty good. Charging wirelessly. So that's pretty good. And you can see it, it doesn't come off. It moves a little bit, but still charging. That's pretty decent. So what I'm going to do, I'm bring the old school, this one back. Anchor. Let's go ahead and see if it works through. This one is 
fully charged as you can see. Let's see. There we go. It is charging. Let's see wireless charging. So we can get it again. Say it. There you go. Wireless charging. Hopefully it comes up again. wireless charging right there so it's working so what we're going to do real quick we're going to go ahead and get to the we're going to use the pixel pro to do some video it and we're going to get into putting the galaxy 23 ultra through the cases be right back we're now using the pixel pro 8 and so we can give the galaxy 23 ultra it says now i do like this case right here case right here because it has the sliding door which does protect the camera so i do like it this is how it looks guys sorry for my greasy hands and we we do have a like that now the reason why i got two of these are, is because sometimes i'm finding out that I put this on the regular way how it's supposed to be is on and you get it won't charge now i'm gonna tell you why this is because sometimes what happens is guys these the way these are built with this extra cushion back here and i think the ring is a little bit off so when you put it in like this come here it won't do it the regular way. But what you have to do on this particular case, I think the ring is off a little bit. So you have to put it upside down. I don't know why you have to do it like that. And there you go. It comes with the wireless charge. See? So the thing is that if you put it the right way it's supposed to be, for some reason, it won't do it at all on these right here but if you put it upside down turn it on there you go you got it so i don't know why it's like this with these right here but there it goes see it's charging so for some reason you have to put it upside down but now when i go ahead and get the anchor one and i put the anchor one on it automatically comes up see that and you know the anchor one i love it but you know so it's 14 minutes until charge now these are talking about the same because it says 14 minutes see 14 until fully charged so they're putting out the same about the same amount of output right here and then we have this one here, which I bought at the mall. And this one doesn't have. I'm trying to get this out of here, guys. Give me one second. See, as you can see, this one doesn't have this cushion here. And the ring is about the same. I think this is a little. The ring is a little off. Maybe my eyesight is a little bad, but let's go ahead and put this on. This cost me about 20, 23 25 dollars at the mall. As you can see, it's still pretty good. You know, I, I like it, the color. Now let's go see see let's see how it's sorry, I'm getting tongue tied. Let's see how it it goes. Boom. It's on. There you go. See? So on this one here, it goes on like it's supposed to. So what I think it is, the rank, this is not placed where it needs to be placed at. Could be a defect or it could be the way they designed it. And I think because of this this padding here, they got in between here where this one doesn't have the padding, that as soon as you slap it on, it comes on. And we could try it with the anchor. Make sure it's on. And there you go. Anchor works as well. So, 
I do like these guys. And um, I do like all of the cases that I bought. Now, um, I might return this one because of the fact it, you know, I do like the case because it has this right here to protect the camera lens. But I don't like the fact that I think it's interfering. The reason why you have to put it upside down because this ring is a little off. I think this ring is just a little off. So, guys, why don't we get back to the regular view, give you my last thoughts, and give it a grade. Yo, 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 I'm back, everybody, to give you my final thoughts. And what do I think about the um, power bank? And to be honest with you guys, um, I told you at the very beginning of the, um, the cut-in that please do not buy these. I do like these. I like these a lot. They're small. Um, you know, they can fit in your purse, they can fit in your pocket. I was getting these, um, for my wife so that she could have an easier time just being able to charge something. But I had to rush out the house one day before I got the video, um, before I got the video completed. So I took the batteries with me just to see how they were perform. And that's when I found out that this right here was not centered right. So I went to the mall and got another one to see if it just was this or was it because of the batteries. And that's when I found out these batteries actually get very hot. When I mean hot, I mean hot to the point where I couldn't even touch them. Now, what I did do is say, you know me, well, I don't know if you do know, but I'll, I'll send stuff back. And I'm like, maybe I got a bad batch. You know, sometimes they come off the assembly line. They're not right. Um, something wrong with them is a bad batch. So I sent, um, you know, contact Amazon, let them know what's hap what happened. They send me, um, a fresh new, a uh, fresh new set. This right here, they sent me this and these overheat as well. So I don't know if it's just a whole bad batch you know, got messed up or it's a really bad flaw in their design that even though it's really thin, it's really light, but because um, I don't know if it's not getting no air circulation or they didn't use, um, they use cheap wiring or whatever they use in these. Cause I don't know what they use in these. It gets really hot and it gets hot around the input. Now, when I charge these up, they don't get hot. It's only when, they are on the back of your phone for a long period of time. And I mean, I've had this on watching movies, the anchor one, watching movies. I watched a couple of things with it and it got warm, but you know, I know it's going to get warm because it's charging, but it didn't get to the point where I was like, Oh, it's going to catch on fire. These right here got to the hot to the point where I thought they were going to catch on fire. So, I'm telling you, do not buy these right here. If you see these, I don't care what type of, um, I don't care what type of deal they have or what the reviews say, guys. Both of the, both of the, um, the one I got and then the one they sent me, both of them got hot. And it's a good price. Um, I think this was what, 20, $21.99 for two 5,000 milliamp hour battery packs. Not a not a bad deal at all. And plus, I'm loving the fact that it's mag safe. But do not get them. Now, as far as the cases, yes, I will put these in the... Um, I'll try to find one similar to this. I got this at the mall just to make sure. I'll put these put these in the description down below. Um, and I will put the description of the batteries below so you know which ones not to get. So you will see this. It's going to say, do not buy... Um, and these are made from, they say every, um, event, I'm sorry, event, eventronics, eventronics, E V E N T R O N I C e eventron, eventron, eventronic. So I would say don't buy them guys. And I, what I think this is because it didn't have that name. When I bought them, it was another company. So they might be like a mass producer of, of batteries like this and another company come in, buy them and put their name on them. But they're really made by this group here. So if you see anything like this and it's a no, it's a no name, don't buy it. Get an anchor, get something else that you might have dealt with 
before you buy it because they have some other thin ones and I'm going to look for another thin one. I might not be able to get a double pack, but I get something thin. Try that out because I'm trying to give something to my wife so she can put it in her purse. Dangerously high to the point I thought it was going to blow up. So I'm going to give these an E. You don't get these. This, I do like this. Now, I don't know. I think it's because the thickness of the case. So you might want to find something that is a little thinner for this case. And I think this case was $19.99. So for $19.99, Right here, guys, I will say, I don't think this was $19.99. If not, it'll be in the description below. $19.99, I will definitely say this is a decent case. If you're not looking for the MagSafe, um, or you have, like, the Anchor, it, and the Anchor did work. I didn't have to put it upside down. It did work. So it could have just been the way that this is this is made. But, you know, the thickness might have something to do with it as well. But I do like it. I like the Pixel Pro 8 one, too. As well, all this will be in the description below. So I do. I like. I like. I'm liking the MagSafe stuff, guys. So, um, like I said, I'm gonna buy my wife one for her. Um, for her Pixel Pro Seven, uh, Pixel Seven Pro. I'm saying it backwards, and so she can be able to use the MagSafe. I might just have to get her an anchor, maybe a pink one for her, or try to find something a little thin because she she says she likes it a little little heavy. You know, I don't think it's heavy, but she said a little heavy, so I'm going to try and find something thinner for her to use. I just want to thank everybody for the growth of the channel. We got a lot of new subs. Thank you. So I want to thank my new subscribers and my current subscribers, the OGs, for rocking with the channel. This is your boy, V. Ghetto Aga for AKA Patrick Tech thanking you for rocking out with me on another unboxing, guys. I can't stress this enough. Do not get these. You don't need nothing burning down in your house or you in your car using this and something catching fire. Please don't get these. And guess what, guys? I got some more unboxes coming soon. So stay tuned for some new, new unboxes and I'll see you guys later. Peace.